Enlarge the Note 8 gets ripped apart. That's a lot of pieces a new device has come out, so it's time for Wirefixer to attack the phone with a battery of heat pads, pry tools, and screwdrivers. The site recently tore the Samsung Galaxy Note 8 is under, revealing its gooey innards. And I mean gooey literally, because as usual, the Note 8 case is assembled mostly with glue. The front and back glass panels are affixed to the device with glue, and the battery is glued in. Getting access requires lots of heat pads and gentle prying. As much as iFixer doesn't like it, glue is a reality of the smartphone industry, though, fasteners are big and expensive. The glue probably also helps with water and dust resistance which seems to be accomplished by a rubber gasket around the perimeter of the device. While iFixer disapproved of the usual glued together construction, the site praised the Note 8 for having several modular components. The headphone jack is easily removable via a plug. The USB-C port lives on a separate daughter board as opposed to being soldered to a single board. Enlarge the Note 8 separated from its mid-frame. With the glass back popped off, you can see how the highly advertised spend requires a big void in the phone the grey strip next to the battery for storage. As a result, the battery in the Note 8 is 200 mAh smaller than Samsung's other big phone, the Galaxy S8. From the teardown, it's easy to see just how skinny the battery is and how little space it occupies inside the phone comparatively. iFixit also took a look at the Note 8's camera system. Samsung is now up to four cameras in the Note, the usual front camera, a second front camera for iris unlock, a regular rear camera, and a second rear camera for an optical zoom and depth of field effect. The site showed off how the optical image stabilization works thanks to a sweet X-ray machine. The black dots surrounding the cameras in this picture are magnets which stabilize the camera. You can see the full tear down over at iFixit.